Alright. Hey there, YouTube. Um, yeah, I haven't made a video in a while. I'm sick, as you can tell. Um, summertime's coming, so I should be coming out with a lot of new videos. Uh, I've been good, really. I've been hitting the gym a lot. And um, I've been trying supplements out and stuff. And it's going good for me. I'm doing good right now. After, like, my breakup and shit with my girlfriend. But I'm doing alright. Uh, today I'm going to be dipping some Skull Spearmint. It's new in Canada. Well, down here. I don't know if about other places, but I just know about down here. It's other down here, right? No, I'm just kidding. But, anyways, yeah. They got Spearmint now, Skull Spearmint. And they got Copenhagen Wintergreen. So I've been dipping both hardcore. The song that's playing now is I Love You This Big by Scotty McQuarrie, or Mc I can't even pronounce his last name, but he's on American Idol, he won, he's a good kid, uh, yeah, my family supported him almost the whole way, and yeah, he, he's just, he's just really good, I like that kid, anyways, here, I'll throw a big pinch in, mm. I really like this dip though, but mm, I'll try to describe it. It's hard to describe. It's it's just it's good, right? Super Expressin said this was his favorite dip. He said that to me once, and now I understand why. Uh, it's not my favorite dip though, but like we all have our own opinions and stuff. But it's it's surely my top five. Cool spearmint looks like that. I think I did another video before about the cans, how they're they're making them into like American cans type fish now. But uh, I'd rate this dip a good nine on ten, nine point five on ten maybe. Um, ever since it came out, it came out like a month and a half ago, not even maybe a month ago. And I've already dipped like maybe eight, nine cans of this and like eight, nine cans of like Copenhagen Wintergreen. I'm starting to dip a lot. Like I dip like a can, a can and a half a day now. But I pack like big enough lips now. But uh, yeah, like I said, summer's coming up. So I'm going to be making a lot of more videos. And I hope you guys like my videos because I'm going to be back for some more. Um... I was going to do my full 10 video, I know I'm sorry about that guys, I'm really sorry, I was supposed to do it, then I booked it again, and I booked it again, but uh, I don't know, I'm going to try to do it, I'm trying really hard, I just really don't have the time, I mean, I'm trying new supplements out for the gym and stuff, and I just, a 10's expensive down here too, M money's not really my problem, right? I, I can get the money to get it, it's just like, I don't know, I can't afford to be sick and shit, but I will do it. I have a buddy that said he would do it with me, and I keep reminding him, reminding him, reminding him. Um, so we'll probably do a full 10 together. He wants to do it just to say he did it. I want to do it for 100 subs. Um, that's pretty much it. He's one of my good buddies. He does... He doesn't do videos, but I'm trying to get him into videos. He's French, obviously, because I go, like, all my friends are French down here. Um, but, yeah, he, he this is probably his favorite dip. That's what he was saying. This is, like, my one of my top fives. Uh, my first is probably Grizzly Wintergreen. I even made a pin on my hat. I remember I used to have that Copenhagen Wintergreen on there, but I took that off. Um, but... Like, the Copenhagen Wintergreen tastes like the American Copenhagen Wintergreen, but I find it a little more salty. Uh, but it's still not the same. Like, the taste isn't isn't really there. Skull improved a lot. Like, I had Skull Wintergreen, American. I had Canadian first. I used to dip that all the time. I have a bunch of videos of me dipping that. I kind of got sick of it. I tried American. That was pretty good. And then I started dipping Wintergreen again, like, or, uh, Skull, and then I tried uh, the new Skull Wintergreen from Canada, and it tastes exactly like the American stuff. The cans look alike. They improve the dates on them. Like they're all like these are all fresh tins now. 
And uh, all the cans in Canada now have metal lids. I've tried the new cherry, the new citrus, the new berry. I've tried almost all the new dips like this. Um, they improved a lot. The nicotine in them is going up too. So you get a better buzz, but like berry and cherry and stuff still won't cut it for me because, I mean, I'm not really, like I used to dip a lot of fruity flavors back in the day. You know, everyone thought they could, everyone thought they could dip back in the day, dipping like fucking fruity flavors, pulling out their lips, and yeah, taking tiny ass pinches. But, um, yeah, so, uh, I haven't been doing videos for a while, like, so I'm kind of, I'm kind of a little bit rusty on this stuff, but uh, I've been I've been good. I've been hanging on. I've been I've been sick though. Like I've been sick like a lot. Uh, I was up two nights ago. I was just getting so sick. Um, I hadn't had a dip all day, and I think that's another thing why I was go I was I was I was sick because like when I don't have my dip, I don't feel like doing anything anymore. Um, everyone's like, oh, you should slow down on dipping, you should quit dipping, you should quit dipping, but you know what, I'm with you guys, I love my dip, I love you guys' YouTube, and dipping's my life, I mean, I can't just stop, you know, anyways, I'm going to talk more about this dip now, um, it's cheap when you go, like, the can, the prices on these went up too, like, four, four bucks, I think it is, four or five bucks, so tin's really expensive now, but I still get good deals because I go on the res, and uh, I pay like 15 bucks a tin now on the reserve. That is, but if you go down to the the convenience stores and stuff, the price is just jacked up. Um, other than that, yeah, I've been really good. I'm starting to wear my Phillies hat again. Fall season is coming. I cut my hair so it doesn't fit right right now, but when my hair grows in, I should be. I'm gonna like start wearing it just normal again. Um, that's pretty much it. Uh, other than that, I don't really know what to say right now. So I'm probably just gonna jam out some music for the rest of the night. Probably get some rest because I'm going to the gym early tomorrow. I just started test boosters. I started T-ball. They're pretty, they're pretty good. Um, I find they're really good for like a, a good test booster. They, uh, like, I started them early today. And, um, six pills a day, but if you guys are looking to like jack up, gain some muscle and size, and cut a little bit, I recommend test boosters. But don't try steroids, just steroids are dumb. If you guys want to get muscle, just go down to like down here. We have naturally fit and GNC. I don't know if you guys have that in the states, but just if you guys are going to start working out, protein's the way to go, and creatine. But this isn't really like a like a workout review, so I'm gonna cut it here before I go really off subject. But um I love you guys, I love you YouTube, I love my dip. If you ain't spitting, you ain't dipping. Maddie Kazoo.